when your cheap plastic tripod breaks, it's time to get a new one. I'm Kevin Muldoon and in this video what I would like to do is show you the Ravelli AVTP Professional 75mm video camera tripod with fluid trackhead. This tripod was designed specifically with video recording in mind. You can use it to do those beautiful panning and tilting shots that you see used in professional videos. The tripod that I used before was also made by Ravelli. It wasn't an expensive tripod, it only cost £6, so I can't really grumble with it breaking after using it for a year. So I didn't have any reservations about buying from them again. As you can see, the AVTP comes with its own carry case. Ravelli have also thrown in a little cleaning cloth and a little keyring light. Now the AVTP retails at about £100 on Amazon UK, but when you open it up and set it up, you can see where this extra money has been spent. This is a sturdy piece of equipment. All the legs are made of hard steel, and all the other components are made of hard plastic. I did however notice a lot of scuffs and marks in the plastic parts of the tripod. This could be because it was damaged in the box during transport, or because they've sent me an item that was returned by someone else. The tripod feet are very flexible. You can move the feet around in any direction that you want, and you can also move the feet up to reveal spikes. This is really useful if you're filming outside and you want to put the tripod on a surface such as grass. The AVTP is very easy to extend. All you have to do is turn the cog and the legs will drop down. It's a three section tripod so there's two parts that you can drop down and once you've got them down all you have to do is turn the cog again and that will secure everything in place. When it is collapsed the tripod has a length of 28.5 inches. It has a minimum operating height of 27 inches and a maximum operating height of 54.5 inches. The tripod uses a 75mm bowl. This gives you a lot of flexibility when you're trying to position your video camera. You can choose a different fluid head if you wish, but the one that's provided is really good and it comes with a spirit level to help you check the balance of the tripod. The fluid head features a detachable plate. All you have to do is push the button at the side and the plate will be released. Then what you do is secure your camera, pop it back in, and then use the lever at the side to secure it. You have to make sure that you secure your camera in so that when you're tilting and panning, your camera is not going to fall off. The tripod helps you get those beautiful panning shots by allowing you to rotate 360 degrees. That's fantastic if you want to get an outdoor shot. You can also tilt a full 180 degrees. The speed at which you tilt can be changed using the black adjustment handle at the side of the fluid head and the speed at which you pan can be changed using the silver adjustment knob at the base of the fluid head. These are essential features so it's great to see them included with this tripod. The included instruction manual is a little short but it does detail everything you need to know about this tripod. The only omission from the main diagram is the hook and drawstring that is attached to one of the tripod legs. This can be used to weigh down your tripod if the tripod is a little off balance. I'm the first to admit that when it comes to producing videos, I'm a beginner. One of the things that I have realised with my past videos is that all of the videos have been recorded from a fixed position. This is because the tripod that I had previously was designed specifically for photography and not for producing videos. Being able to add tilts and pans into my videos is really going to add a more professional element to the videos and hopefully it will make me produce better reviews. I hope you've all enjoyed this review of the Ravelli AVTP. If you're looking for a video tripod, I really do encourage you all to check it out. It's a great tripod and for the money, it really is a bargain, especially when you consider the cost of other brands out there such as Manfrotto. Please do consider liking or subscribing if you did enjoy the video. And as always, if you have any questions, please do leave a comment below and I'll do my best to answer them. Till next time guys, thanks for watching and take care.